Hey, Stash. You are looking Hello. pretty good for someone who has COVID. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. So um, I know that you got COVID from a friend when you're having dinner last Monday. Can you tell us um, how long it took for some symptoms to appear? Yeah, so I think kind of symptoms took about uh, four days to appear. I think it was mostly it's kind of Friday that hit me. Um, but uh, I know it can be shorter for some. Uh, I think some of my friends, it was, you know, as quick as the day after or two days after. Um, and then for me, it was quite a kind of short and sharp thing um, where I had kind of one bad day, uh, which was I, I sort of just felt kind of achy and uh, had a bit of a fever. Um, I had a temperature of about 38 degrees Celsius and... Um, uh, but then, yeah, after that, I was quite quickly kind of fine again. And so since then, I've just been dealing with the lingering effects of, you know, a cough and uh, other things like that. And you've been working all this time, haven't you? <laughs> working hard. Yeah. <laughs> Never stops. Such a trooper. <laughs> so um, how has it been for you at home recovering? I mean, what have you had to do? Do you have to eat something or, or take any treatments? Or Yeah, I mean, you know, I've just been, you know, trying to take care of myself. Um, I did lose my appetite, actually. That's one thing. I kind of, when I was ill, I just didn't really feel like eating anything. And, and I'm, I'm someone that normally eats quite a lot. So that was, uh, that was unusual. So I had to kind of, I suppose, fight against my body's urge not to eat and, uh, and force myself to kind of keep myself obviously hydrated and also to eat uh, lots of food obviously had all the kind of um vitamin c and uh, all that kind of stuff uh, fruit and veg and and then you had also just some um very simple uh kind of cough uh, rather sorry cold medicine uh, as well which has helped a little bit so i remember actually you went to uh the uk uh, over christmas to see your family but you never caught it then so no, how did you manage uh, not to catch it back then uh, when i was there it was the uh, it was the omicron wave uh in the uk and it seemed like everyone was getting it i was just pretty careful i guess i didn't spend any time indoors really in public places uh either outdoors or in a private place like someone's home i was obviously wearing, wearing my mask everywhere i also wasn't taking public transport i was cycling everywhere despite the bitter cold of london in december mm. um so generally speaking i was i was taking all the precautions i could so for someone who gets COVID in Taiwan, what is the exact protocol? If, you, if you're kind of developing symptoms and so on, they will take you for uh, a PCR test, I believe, is the, the kind of current protocol to kind of confirm your infection. Um, they sent me a nice little goodie box of, oh. of things. Yeah, I've had some What I've was in your noodles. box? Uh, it's got um, some kind of, uh, what do you call them? Uh, instant noodles and uh, some biscuits. Uh, a few, a couple of rapid tests and a thermometer. I think that was it. Was there any point where you were anxious or afraid that it could get a lot worse? There was one point uh, in the night where uh, I kind of, I woke up and my throat was kind of quite tight. Um, and, you know, it was still okay. But, and, and I, I, I could get, get back to sleep and everything. But I did kind of think, well, I, I, I wouldn't want it to get any more tight than this. Do you know what I mean? Which does make me think, you know, I'm, I'm very grateful for uh, being protected, uh, having had three doses of a vaccine. Um, and, you know, if I, if I were in, uh, you know, in weaker health or had other underlying health conditions and wasn't vaccinated, I, I would definitely look at this virus and, and, and feel a bit more worried. But, um, but, you know, if you have the protection, then I think it's, it's something that most people can get through without too much of a problem. Well, we're so glad that it hit you fairly lightly and uh, that it looks like you'll be out soon, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, you know, happy to be out fairly soon.